guys. This is how my morning starts. Just go and get the ghost sorted. We have concrete floors now. Yesterday I watered it all and uh, after feeding and letting out the goats we'll have to water it again. Watering of the concrete basically prevents it from cracking. Uh, it's just one of the drying processes that cracking can occur and uh, by wetting it you escape it. I've been cleaning up a little bit and also started building something down here. Let's see how they're doing. Hello. <laughs> Everybody seems all right. Your new friends all right. Yeah. All right, let's get you some grain, guys. Goats are eating. I'm gonna make sure the yeah leashes are in a good position. Plenty of grass. Uh, I only moved them fresh yesterday, so it should be okay still. Yeah. All right, we got plenty to go on. Yesterday the candy came here and uh, she's been doing a number on the, on this tree. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready? I think others are still eating. Ready to go out? Yeah? Yeah, there's a leaf. Glad I've been outside. <laughs> Some snack. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> yeah, this is your spot down here, look. favorite tree. <laughs> They're all excited to get out. Uh, you know what spot's gonna be here? Gotta snatch a little bit somewhere, don't you? <laughs> Boy Atlas, he's a new addition to the goat family. Uh, he's gonna be a boy for the herd. I'll get their water to them. Here we are, everybody's happy. Eating away, especially you. Terrorizing this tree. <laughs> she can help me with pruning later I have to get all this sorted Jesus you like this tree don't you 
it's very important to put them close enough but not too far in so they can wrap themselves around the tree otherwise they'll just get stuck they're not the cleverest of the animals but uh, the great escape artists though as they're here we'll uh, I think we'll find out when the heat comes in and the boy tries to get to the girls I think I have to do a bit more work on the pens so we can't get to them otherwise obviously we'll have mating when we don't want to <laughs> Ventilation, all the windows have to be left cracked open. Otherwise, condensation will start collecting. Obviously, wouldn't have, so it wouldn't be the best idea to get so much, so much moisture introduced. But yeah, here we are. I'll do this again at the end of the day. So I've done a little bit more work on the coops. And uh, we upgraded the stands for the goats, so they actually have their feeding buckets now as well as the as well as the uh, salt. And everybody got their own hangable buckets as well. Nice and snazzy. Oh, and the uh, feeders. The bags weren't weren't working, uh, weren't any good, so that's what we're going for. It works so much better, and also they lay a bit on the floor, which we're not really bothered about, just because it's it's gonna get cleaned up anyway. It's gonna go all all go into compost, so it won't be that bad. In general, it's been a good day. It wasn't too hot either because we've been baking lately and it was just easy going day to day. Sandra is uh, getting ready to go to go back in and pack in for the day. Start again tomorrow. Oh yeah! <laughs> This is why we need an electric fence so we can just let them go like this, don't we? Yep, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> no, wait. <laughs> you gotta say. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> <laughs> so after getting all the goats back in i'm going to wet the concrete again and that'll be the end of the day <laughs> <laughs>